Hello everybody and welcome to another MX Bikes video and today guys we are going to be doing another track review on a brand new track I'm pretty sure that released yesterday that you're watching this today for me but it is called Dade City MX. This is a real track located in Florida so this is a replica and it's made by Consuming Clouds and the, the interesting part about this track and the way he built it is it is very flat. There's absolutely no pre-made roughness. There's a little bit on the face of these jumps you can see here but uh something i really haven't done too much of in mx bikes is mess with the e-road and and actually make my own lines through the track and so i was like why why don't we why don't we do that for this one here oh look at that cupped out little hip jump there into the sand section so that's what we did stick to the end of the video guys um it is a good one i'm gonna do another edit at the end of this video because i don't know i want to do it for every single new track that we get on and I don't know, I think it's another cool way to show off the track and it's just, I don't know, something that's fun to do, but oh my god, the thing with this sand section is it has sand traction and since we're obviously on normal traction on the normal main track that we just got off of, uh, we don't have sand tires on, we have regular mid-softs which have absolutely horrible traction on sand, so you kind of got to stand up as much as you can, you got to let the bike roll around which is the opposite of what you'd actually do in sand, you'd be on the power, but this is MX Bikes, it's not real life, so obviously the physics don't really line up, but I've tried to Euro the sand section, I think he might have messed up a little bit, because there's obviously parts here that aren't eroding, and the ones that do are eroding a bit weird, but it's not a huge error, I don't think a lot of people are going to be running 5 erode on this track, but listen man, I'm uh, if I'm going to do a track, it's, it almost has to be rough, like... I know I ride stock tracks a lot. You guys have watched me know that, but I think with a custom track, man, you gotta you gotta make it rough, especially if it's a replica. So I've kind of tried to make my own lines. I have that outside line there. I'm trying to make this inside one. I have this really cool rut. Oh, I missed it, but that rut on that berm is super fun. You just hook right into it. And then I made this little rut through the whoops. Ooh. So I've kind of just, I've turned the track into a bit of a one-liner here, but before it really had no lines, so I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm doing Consuming Clouds a bit of a favor here, bro. I really would recommend you come in here and make some pre-made roughness, and you can even use this video to see the lines I'm taking, because I think this is probably close to the fast line here. But, oh, that rut on that face is so deep. Oh, I love this rut here. Slow down, get on the power. Didn't really hook into it, but... Super, super fun, man. This game, it doesn't have the best e-road system, I will say. But if you do it right, you set it to the right amount, you could have a ton of fun, dude. Oh, my God. I sent a fatty on that one. Hit one of those booter lips, but... The sand is interesting. It's very interesting. I mean, if you're going to make a sand section, it's got to be rough, man. You know, I stand behind that. And honestly, I probably wouldn't do sand texture... Um, unless you're gonna make the whole the whole track sand texture because people will be running mid softs and they're gonna hop on this and be like, dude, I can't even ride it. It's so tough on mid softs. The back end's just mega swap, and we're also on the KTM 250. I don't really hop on this bike too much, but I thought, why not? I kind of want to hop on some different bikes, and I do like the KTM a fair bit amount. It's actually, I think, the fastest 250 as far as just top speed in the game. That's pretty interesting. And also, if you're worrying about the setup, just stock. I'm just running stock KTM here. No special setup. Oh, get me out of the sand section, dude. This is absolute torture, bro. As far as the looks, though, I do like the way the track looks. I do think that the texture, as far as on the track, not a huge fan of it just being one texture. I like when there's a, a bit of lines in it. Um, again, pre-made roughness will fix all those problems, I think. Oh my goodness, dude. I just got absolutely booted out of that rut. The biggest problem with the KTM and Husky is the suspension. It's very, very stiff in this game. Let's see if we can hop into this rut. You get that little booter and you just hop into that rut right there. Oh, it's so fun. Oh, see what I mean, man. If I'm on the Yamaha Honda, dude, I'm landing out of that easily. This really might have been the worst bike to take on this track. I'm not going to lie. Alright, I'm going to rail this corner. 
Oh, looks right in. Throw a fat whip on this thing. Oh no, we're going to flat. Oh, I don't know how we saved that. Oh, this rut's fun too. Oh, cross rut. And the back end stuck in it. Was that a four wheeler? I think it was massive. Whoo! That's off the track. Nice. It's fine. We can just hop right back into our rut here. Oh! Dude, I was moving earlier. I'm just choking, bro. Alright, so this track has three different layouts. One is a tiny layout, which I probably won't show you. It's just on this main track. We're doing the full loop right now, but... Dude, I am... I'm struggling with the suspension. I think this is... Yeah, this is the main track right here. So you take this corner. Yeah, it basically just cuts off the sand, but... Let's do a few laps of just this. So I want to show more of these ruts off a little bit. I want to hook into them a little bit better. See, that one's really nice. Whoo! That thing's a send on a 250. Oh my goodness. You can rail this outside. A little bit slower here. Oh no. It's like if you land front end first, you just... You're just losing it, dude. It's just gone. There we go. That was cool. <laughs> but yeah, I think if you are going to get a track that, you know, you're going to make a track that's flat, doesn't have a lot of roughness, I think advertising a good E-Road setting, I, I don't think this is probably the best one. You can see it's it's fairly glitchy and fairly rigid. Um, I'd probably do like three, two and a half, three E-Road. If you spin enough laps... You can get some pretty good ruts in here, but you should advertise that in the description. Dude, it's too deep now. I should start the video earlier. Let me try this one more time. Because once you hook in, dude, oh, it's so fun. It's so satisfying. Stay on the outside. Oh, man, I just lost the front end. Oh, it's so deep, dude. Oh, my God. Oh! oh, imagine I land that, dude. That would be crazy. All right, let's do one more lap here. Okay, where's the finish line? I don't even know. I think it's up here. It's soon. Oh, wait, my laps aren't going to count because I'm doing the little track. Whatever. Oh! All right, let's hook into this rut. Let's go to the inside one. Okay, survive. Nope. Dude, I, just, I wish the KTM had good suspension, dude. It would be the best bike for outdoors. Just because it has so much speed. Oh, I tried to get into that rut. Just the suspension. It won't sink in, man. It's too stiff. You just slide over it. Alright, let's see if we can get this one. So that was my fault. I was way too far in. Even with the ruts in this game, you have to ride the outer edge. You're just going to lose that front tire. Try this one. There we go. Oh, that was sick. We just hopped into that. Oh, God. Back in. Oh, that's stupid. Oh my god, that was so sick, dude. <laughs> okay, let's just cut to the edit. Let's just cut to the edit, dude. Thank you guys so much for watching, as always. You guys are absolute Ws. Also, thank you guys again for 20,000 subs. When I started this, dude, I was just doing it for fun. I honestly had no idea, but... Hey, it's taking off. I'm gonna keep doing it. I got all summer to, you know, put some time into it. So, let's make it happen, boys. All right, let's go to the set it.
down on 50 Put it all in the bag, then bring it with me Walk around town, blowing money, baby Condo downtown, for special occasions Spin me round, put money on the floor, then lay me down Run me round, take a break to go another round Best she ever had, yeah, I'm from a different room She broke me out of hell, yeah, I know she ain't Walk around.